Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Airlines Quest. The 2024 Farnborough Air Show saw Boom Supersonic, the ambitious startup aiming to revive supersonic passenger travel, unveil significant updates to its Overture aircraft project. While the company's vision continues to captivate the aviation industry, the announcements also highlighted the complex challenges it faces. At the heart of Boom's presentation was the reveal of Overture's cutting-edge flight deck. Departing radically from traditional cockpit designs, Boom showcased a futuristic interface dominated by large 17-inch touchscreens. This digital-first approach aims to streamline pilot interactions and pave the way for continuous improvements through over-the-air software updates. The company asserts that this design is the result of extensive consultation with airlines, businesses, and military pilots, ensuring a balance of innovation and practicality. However, this heavy reliance on software-based controls has raised eyebrows among industry experts. Concerns about cybersecurity and the reliability of digital systems in critical flight situations have prompted debates about the wisdom of such a departure from conventional cockpit designs. Boom has sought to address these concerns by emphasizing that crucial functions like the stick, throttle, and landing gear will retain physical controls, providing a safety net for essential operations. One of the most intriguing features of the new flight deck is its advanced augmented reality, AR, vision system. This technology promises to eliminate the need for the iconic drooping nose seen on Concorde, allowing pilots to land safely using AR views provided through a head-worn device and the primary flight display. If successful, this could represent a significant advancement in aircraft design and pilot interface technology. On the propulsion front, Boom provided updates on its Symphony engine development program. The company announced that the engine core is expected to be operational within 18 months, marking a crucial milestone in the project's progression. Boom is constructing a test rig for full-scale evaluations and combustor aerodynamic studies, adhering to what it describes as a rapid development approach. While these advancements are impressive, they also underscore the immense technical challenges involved in bringing a new supersonic airliner to market. The complexity of developing a safe, efficient, and economically viable supersonic engine cannot be overstated, and Boom's ambitious timeline has raised questions about the feasibility of their goals. Notably absent from Boom's presentation were concrete updates on the overall project timeline. The company's initial aim to see Overture enter service by the end of the decade now appears increasingly optimistic. The lack of specific progression milestones has led to speculation about potential delays and the project's long-term viability. Despite these challenges, Boom Supersonic's vision continues to excite the aviation industry and the public alike. The promise of drastically reduced travel times and the revival of supersonic passenger flight holds immense appeal. However, the company must navigate a complex landscape of technological development, regulatory hurdles, and economic realities to turn this vision into reality. As the aviation world watches Boom's progress with keen interest, the coming years will be crucial in determining whether the company can overcome the formidable obstacles in its path. The updates revealed at Farnborough 2024 demonstrate both the exciting potential and the daunting challenges of bringing supersonic travel back to the skies. Only time will tell if Boom Supersonic can successfully bridge the gap between its ambitious vision and the practical realities of modern aviation. Drop your thoughts in comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you. Thank you.